Hello friends, today we are going to read Scratch, Scratch, Scratch. The author is Dawa Lamu Yolmo. The illustrator is Samida Gunjal and the publisher is Pratham Books. So let's read Scratch, Scratch, Scratch. So what do you see in this picture here? This girl is scratching her back you know scratching when you use your nails to rub your skin that is scratching she is scratching why is she scratching and what are these red dots on her arms let's read the story and find out what happened every day after school manu plays hopscotch she jumps and counts. One, two, and three. Four, five, and six. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. So here in this picture, you see the girl Manu. Her name is Manu and she has just finished school. You see the school bag is lying on the ground. She's taken off her shoes and she is playing hopscotch. You have seen this game and she is jumping and counting. But today Manu is feeling itchy scratchy on her tummy. She jumps and counts. One, two and three, scratch. Four, five and six, scratch, scratch. Seven, eight, nine and ten, Scratch, scratch, scratch. So what happened? Today, Manu is feeling scratchy on her tummy, on her stomach. And while she is jumping and counting, she is also scratching herself. Why? What is going on? She sees tiny, itchy, scratchy bumps. One, two, and three on her tummy. Four, five, and six on her arms. Seven, eight, nine, and ten on her back. Itchy, scratchy bumps everywhere. So now in this picture, what do you see? She has these red small bumps on her skin. On her tummy, she pulls up her shirt to see it's on her arms, on her back, everywhere. And these bumps are very itchy. She wants to scratch them. You have chicken pox, says Amma. You cannot go to school. So this is her mother. And she says... You have chicken pox. Manu has chicken pox. What is chicken pox? It's a disease that when you get it, you feel very scratchy. You have these little red dots all over your skin, bumps, and you feel like scratching them all the time. And it can spread from one person to another. So Manu cannot go to school while she has chicken pox. Manu plops herself on the bed and goes, scratch, 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 scratch. So then now that Manu can't go to school, what does she do? She plops herself, she puts herself down on the bed and she starts scratching all over. Do not scratch, says Amma. It makes Manu even more itchy scratchy. So you know how when you think you shouldn't do something, you keep thinking about it. So what happens when Manu's mother tells her not to scratch? It makes her even more itchy. She keeps thinking, oh, it's itching. I want to scratch it. And she it makes her want to really scratch it. But her mother tells her not to. 
when amma and baba are not looking scratch after eating porridge scratch scratch so what does manu do she scratches when her parents are not looking at her she eats her porridge and then she is using see this ruler the scale to scratch her back do not scratch yell amma and baba so this is manu's father he also shouts at her don't scratch the bumps but when she lies on the bed again she goes scratch 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 but then again when manu is lying down on her bed she is again feeling like scratching it and again she starts scratching it manu tries and tries not to scratch scratch she plays snakes and ladders she dreams up many stories she forgets to scratch scratch so then what happens Manu is trying to think of other things, not of how she is feeling like scratching. She starts playing games like snakes and ladders. She starts thinking of other things, thinking of some stories. She is coming up with her own stories. See here, you can see all this ice cream and cake and yummy things that she is thinking about. And before you know it, she has fallen asleep and she keeps dreaming. but when she is sleeping she is not scratching slowly the bumps disappear manu counts 10 9 and 8 7 6 and 5 4 3 2 and 1 until one day manu pulls her shirt up all the itchy scratchy bumps are gone so finally what happens this is after some days manu keeps counting how many bumps are left and slowly they start going away they start disappearing and one day she pulls up her shirt and she looks at her tummy and there are no bumps left they are all gone so Manu is well again. Now Manu can play hopscotch. She jumps and counts: one, two, and three; four, five, and six; seven, eight, nine, and ten. So now that she is well, she can go to school again and play with her. friends now there is no danger that she will spread the chicken pox to her friends so she is playing hopscotch again i hope you enjoyed this story thank you the difficult words in this story are itchy to feel like scratching your skin chicken pox a disease that gives you red bumps on your skin and makes you feel like scratching them to plop to drop down try these questions think of the last time you were ill did you stay home from school how did you spend your time think of the last time you got hurt did you have to take care of it how did it feel while it was getting better write about it